Okay, good morning. Um, please check your email for an email from Ms. Holtzapple to sign up for your activity choices for December 22nd, which is the shortened day um, right before winter break. So make your choices, otherwise you'll be assigned to something you maybe don't wanna go to. So make sure you check your email, thanks. Happy holidays. So the holiday decorating contest for the Connect Time Home Rooms is ending on the 12th, I believe. So be sure to decorate your door and your classroom because you might get donuts. FFA meeting, Monday, December 12th, 7 p.m. in the ACK room. Shopware practice is Sunday from 2 p.m. to 4 p.m. There's a chorus and band holiday concert on December 12th at 7 o'clock. Have a good day and happy holidays. Go. Welcome to Game Review with your host, Zach Woodford. Hey, for Game Review, we have Pokemon Go as not being a couch potato. So, Pokemon Go is a very active game. The more you walk around, the better stuff you get in the game. You have to walk around to upgrade your Pokemon. You have to walk around to go get more supplies at Pokestops. And you have to go do things like gyms at very important places in your town. Next we have a low point to the game. The story. The story... It's really quite boring. It's just a lot of dialogue where you get new quests to get new Pokemon. And if you actually read the story, the guy talking acts like you're a ten-year-old who just figured out what a dog is. So, to recap, I say Pokemon Go is an 8 out of 10, with the gameplay being a 7 out of 10, the story being a 3, uh, updates being an 8, in-game events being a 9, timed events being a 4, and couch potato-lessness, <laughs> my favorite, being about a 7. Line one, we have Carnival. And then line two, Big Daddy's Pizza. All right, the beard is finally off, and we have made it to the end of our journey. I hope you've enjoyed this couple of weeks of the Beard Off special with Mr. E, and let him know, what was your favorite beard? Was it the mustache? Was it the handlebars? Was it the pencil beard? And what was your favorite? joke of the week. And I'll leave you with one last joke. I often ask myself, what would Jesus do in many different situations? One of these times, I think I'm just going to grow a beard. Have a good one. <laughs>